this is Arina. Today we are going to make sum sum puh amigurumi. Okay, let's see what we need is yarn in yellow, red and brown color. The yarn I'm using cartonous Bali yarn uh, with the thickness of worsted yarn. So for this one I'm going to use hook with the size of 6, 6 or 3.5 mm and then we need stitch markers tapestry needles safety eyes and the safety nose let's get started so with the yellow yarn, we'll make magic ring. Wrap around your two fingers like this. And then insert your hook. From bottom, go upward and then pull it out. Take out your fingers. Okay. Like this. Slightly, slightly um, make the loop smaller so that it's easier to handle. Okay. So from this magic ring, we are going to make chain one and then six single crochet in the magic ring. Insert in the ring, yarn over and pull out. So we have two yarns here, yarn over and then pull it out. We are making one single crochet now. So let's repeat again for the second single crochet. Insert the hook into the ring yarn over and then pull out the yarn and yarn over and then pull out the second the second single crochet okay once again insert the yarn And then yarn over and pull out both loops. Okay, three single crochet. You can see here we are making one single crochet, two single crochet, and three single crochet. So let's make another three single crochet. Insert into the ring, pull out a loop, yarn over and pull out two loops four single crochet five single crochet six single crochet and then we are going to pull the yarn tail here to tighten it Okay, so now we have first round done. To continue with the second round, we are going to crochet in spiral. So we don't need to um, slip stitch to the first stitch. Okay. Go into the first stitch. I'm going to crochet in back loop only so instead of inserting into these two these two loops I'm going to insert only the back loop okay. instead of these two loops I'm going to insert only at the back loop only which is here okay so let's start second round 
second round we are going to make two single crochet in eight stitches okay let's start with the first stitch here in back loop only make the first single crochet we are going to mark the first the first stitch in second round Okay, so we have marked the first the first stitch. So once we finish, we will reach until the first um, until the stitch marker. That means that we have finished one round. Okay, I'm going to make two sing two single crochet in the first stitch. Okay, so stitch the first single crochet is done. The second single crochet insert into the same stitch here. Pull out a loop and then yarn over and pull out both loops. So we have done two single crochet in the first stitch. Continue with the second stitch. Remember we are going to do only at the back back loop only instead of the both loops okay so inside here we are going to make two single crochet one single crochet two single crochet okay Let's repeat for each stitches in the third stitch. One, two. In the fourth stitch, one, two. Okay, so now we have 12 stitches in the first, in the second round. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, so now we have finished second round. Moving on to the third round, we are going to make one single crochet and the next stitch we are making two single crochet. We repeat it for six times so there will be six stitches increase. Okay. Take out your stitch marker, make the first stitch. This is and mark the first stitch of the third round okay so one stitches here and then in the next stitch we are going to make two single crochet two single crochet okay one in the same stitch two single crochet okay so this is one set we are going to make six set of this okay in the next stitch one single crochet in the next stitch two single crochets one two okay let's repeat until we finish uh, we reach the stitch markers to make round to mark the third round. One here, make two single crochet. Okay, 
Okay. Okay, we have done third round. Continue moving on to the fourth round. We are making two single crochet in the first stitch and then move to one single crochet and one single crochet in the next two stitches. Okay. So in the first stitch of third round, on the fourth round, we are going to make two single crochet here. Mark your first stitch. Okay, inside this again, make the second single crochet. And then in the next two stitches, we are going to make one single crochet each. Single crochet, and then into the next stitch, one single crochet. Okay, so we are going to repeat this, this set for six times. So we fi will finish um, round four. Two single crochet and then one single crochet and one single crochet. Into the next round. Uh, into the next set. Increase. One. Two. Increase one, two. Okay, we have finished fourth round. Let's continue to the fifth round of increase. Okay, for fifth round, we are going to make tr one single crochet in the next three stitches. And then in the fourth stitch, we are going to make two single crochet. Okay. One, mark your first round. Two, three, and then increase here. One, two, three, and then increase. Okay, we are going to make this for six more times until we finish round five. One, two, three, increase. One, Two, three, increase. Last one, last set. One, two, three, increase. Okay. We have done fifth round. Continue to the sixth round. We are going to make two single crochet in the first stitch and then one single crochet in the next four stitches. Okay. So in the first stitch here, we are going to make two single crochet. Which means the it is increased stitches here in the first stitch and then one single crochet for the next four stitches. One, two, three, four. Okay. So increase one, two, three, four. Repeat this for six times.
increase one two three four increase one two three four okay we have finished sixth round moving on the seventh round we are still doing increase so we are going to make one single crochet in the next five stitches and then two single crochet in the next stitch okay one two three four five and then increase okay one two three four five and then increase okay we are going to repeat until we reach the stitch marker okay we have finished round seven now continue to the round eight we are going to make an increase in the first stitch and then one single crochet in the next six stitches okay In the first stitch, we are going to make an increase or two single crochet in one, eh, two single crochet. Okay. And then continue with one single crochet in the next six stitches. One, two, three, four. Five, six. Okay, we'll repeat this until we have fin we have reached our stitch marker. There will be a total of six stitches increase. Increase one, two, three, four. Five, six, okay. Okay, we have finished round eight. Moving on to round nine, we are going to make one single crochet in each stitches, okay. But we are going to add red color yarn here. So, for the yellow yarn, we are going to make 36 stitches, uh, 36 single crochet in yellow yarn. And then we are going to change into red yarn. Okay, let's move on with the first stitch. Okay, mark the first stitch. We are going to make another 35 uh, single crochets okay two three four thirty four thirty five thirty six okay we are going to change yarn so when we are doing the 36 stitch 
instead of yarn over with the yellow color, we are going to yarn over in the red with the red yarn. Okay. Just put the yarn like this and then hold the yarn red yarn tail and then yarn over and pull out a loop so we have now changed it into red color yarn and we are going to finish until uh finish until we reach the stitch marker there will be 12 stitches in red yarn okay continue here one two three four Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 12 okay so this is round 9 okay if you are asking what happened to the yellow yarn I'll just leave it tangling here okay later we'll we'll be needing this again okay for round 10 we are going to make 12 stitches in the red and then continue with yellow until we reach this part and then moving on to change to red color again Okay, round 10, 12 stitches in red, first stitch in round 10, mark with the stitch marker, okay, 12 stitches here, 2, 3, 4, Eleven, twelve. Okay, we are going to change yarn into yellow again. Pull your yarn, pull your yarn across. Okay. And then we are going to continue with yellow yarn until we have reached into the last stitch of yellow here. There will be 24 stitches of yellow yarn. Three, four, five. Twenty three, and then this is the last stitch before red yarn. Pull it out, and then yarn over with the red yarn. And then continue with red yarn. For the next 12 stitches.
11, 12. Okay. So now we have finished 10 rounds. For round 11, we are going to mark the position of the safety eyes at the 21st and 29th stitch. Okay. Don't worry about the shades of red and yellow. We are just following through. Okay. For round 11, 12 stitches in red yarn. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 11, 12 okay take out the yellow yarn to yarn over on the 12 stitch okay then continue um 13 14 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Okay. For this 21 stitch, we are going to place a safety marker. This will be the position for the safety eyes. Okay. Then next seven stitches will be blank and then to, on the eighth stitch we are going to to put the stitch marker again okay. one two three four five six seven and then this will be the 29th stitch from the beginning which is about seven stitches in between we are going to place a safety marker okay there will be one two three four five six seven stitches in between here okay let's continue On the last stitch before the red color, we are going to bring over the red yarn and yarn over to pull out the loop. Okay, continue with red shade now for the next 12 stitches. We have finished round 11. For round 12 and 13, we are just repeating the same thing over again so there will be one stitches for each rounds until we have reached the end of round 13 okay round 12 here continue with the same shades 